What is going on everybody? Bluecore here and I'm going to teach you how to make a game server. We will be using SRB2 this time, but these tips can be used for any game alike. First things first, you need to find out if your internet provider allows port forwarding. Because not all routers can, at least in my experience. So find their number and call them. This will save you from wasting your time. Now that you're 100% sure you can port forward, let's get on with the tutorial. First thing you need to find is your computer's internal IP address and default gateway. To find this in Windows, you must open Command Prompt. For Windows XP, click on Run and type CMD to open it up. If you use Windows Vesta or 7 or 8, Type CMD in your search bar, and you should find it there. For everyone else, double click on your internet side icon, click on support, and you'll find it there. To find it using command prompt, type in IPCONFIG. Now that you know what your gateway is, open up your internet browser and type it in the address bar. To log in, most likely your username will be admin or administrator, and your password will be password in all lowercase, all uppercase, or just the P uppercase. If none of those work, in the description I have provided a link to a great website where there are other logins. Now that you are logged in, you need to find the port forwarding tab. For me, it's under advanced. To port forward the port, we are going to go to Add Service, Service Name Other, Other Service, call it SRB2, Service Type UDP, Service IP Address, use the IP you got from the command prompt, Start and Endpoints, both use 5029, then hit Save. Now, all we have to do is unblock the port in the firewall. Keep in mind, if you have an antivirus with the firewall, or just want to do the lazy way, you can turn off your firewall altogether when you're hosting and skip this part. But for those who want to be safe, you're going to open your firewall, go to exceptions, click on add port, and name, SRB2, port number, 5029, click on UDP, OK, and you're done. Now time to test it out.